Yeah, what's up guys? The guy here again. Okay. Uh, decided to, to walk around man. You know I arrived today like two hours ago in this city. It's called it's called uh, Arusha. Uh, I mean yeah Arusha. So we are in Arusha, Tanzania right here. And you know what? Just decide to walk in the street. Looks very busy. So we're gonna walk. Um, realizing I don't have enough battery, it's gonna go off anytime from now. But before it goes off, let's just have a walk. You know, discovering Africa is what we do, right? So we're gonna do it to the fullest until we can't do it anymore. I'm kind of like lost. So I don't know anything around here. I'm new. So I'll definitely ask for advice for those who know the area. Tell me what you see. Have you come to this city? What happened? Are you from here? What can you tell us about the city? We're here about educating each other. Thank you so much for loyal people who come through every single time when I post a video and they want to watch it. And those who also invite people to come and watch my videos. Thank you so much. I also want to thank my special host in this city is um, I can't like really fail to call your name man is it of Pentus we are yet to meet but he's been he's been kind of like hosting me online thing so we haven't met as yet but it's been you know so much of help he's been supporting me yeah putting on some funds in my number so i can pay a, a, a lodge stuff like that man thank you so much um i really appreciate what you are doing to me and uh, yeah let me also appreciate those who have subscribed to my channel those who saw value in my videos and they decided to subscribe for more I want to thank you so much. This is what we don't like, we YouTubers. Copyright. So I think I'm about three streets down. Just hope I'm not going to get lost. <laughs> uh, this is my very first time in this city. And we can like just discovering man I mean walking in Arusha who wouldn't want that so I made it possible for all of us we are literally walking in Tanzania in Arusha the city is known for its proximity with Nairobi I was told it's only about five hours four to five hours drive and you find yourself in Nairobi from here it's also not far from Mombasa and uh, the best and in the country is the city where you come to when you are visiting Kilimanjaro mountain <laughs> yeah man This is actually your best city you wanna come. Okay. So yeah. Quite beautiful. 
buildings this one is called Arusha Trade Center Equity Bank this one looks like I was told the city is really safe so I'm giving it a try holding my GoPro in my hands and walking again you guys we're walking for 15 minutes and we get back let's just hope the battery will allow us what do you think about this city what do you compare it with tell us in the comment section i don't know i'm yet to So think of what city I will compete with. Yeah. Here they speak uh, Swahili as the prime language. I love it. You go in offices, you go in government offices, you go in corporate they are speaking Swahili and it's amazing so yeah guys I've heard other countries want to adopt Swahili such as South Africa not sure how far they are with the project but South Africa want to speak Swahili guys let me know is this the best way I'm going is this the best street to walk first in Arusha let me know man um, I just stepped out of the hotel and start walking so literally I've got no idea of anything around Kind of like, look like there are a lot of old buildings though some of them are being renovated doesn't look like there are any new buildings around that's what I call or something so I think this one is being renovated or let us know if you've been around so yeah still your guy here we are eight eight minutes now and counting let's hope we'll make it to 15 minutes uh, i see most shops are already closing it's roughly about 17 hours I was also told the area is mostly Maasai and those are the ones we see ahead of us literally they wear like that on a daily basis it's not anything like because they are coming from any event okay this looks new from Arusha talk to us tell us what you think I see the video still on and we are at nine ten minutes now I'm yet to find the street name this street 
um, I think I miss reading it from up there but we're gonna find uh, from the board there Sokoine, Sokoine Road. So this is Sokoine Road. Hope I'm calling it right. Sokoine, it's actually written Sokoine. I will, I will definitely think they will call it Sokoine. beautiful building that also looks new I think I'm starting to realize um I might have been wrong to say that there are no new buildings but in this city you will realize so many of so many of um, 4x4 cars because you know this is a touristic city it's more like Livingstone in Zambia the Livingstone is close to the Victoria Falls and this one is close to the world most heritage mountain which is the Kilimanjaro which makes it the tallest in the in the in the, in the continent in Africa and uh, one of the tallest in the in the world I think it's top two or top three guys let, let us know this is also looks new you see even government signs are written in uh, uh, Swahili but their official language I think is Swahili and English but they prefer to speak more Swahili and less English 